2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross Review, Eclipsed by the Competition. Even when it first arrived in the USA as a 2018 model, the Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross had an uninspired powertrain and a forgettable driving experience. Not a good start, considering it competes in the cutthroat compact SUV market against some of America's top-selling cars such as the Toyota iV4 and Honda CR-V. It slid steadily down the rankings until last year's midlife update gave it sharper looks, got rid of the odd split rear window, and updated the in-car tech, dragging it closer to the class average. Now the 2023 Eclipse Cross is here, and it's hardly any different from last year's model, so it seems unlikely to challenge the segment leaders anytime soon. It's still saddled with the same lethargic 152 horsepower engine and humdrum handling. It doesn't help that neither the IIHS nor the NHTSA's safety review of the Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross scored it very highly. It looks like it's going to be an uphill struggle for the little underdog. 2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross changes, what's the difference vs the 2022 Eclipse Cross? After an update last year that included a facelift and a much-needed overhaul of the infotainment system, very little is new for the 2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross. The biggest news is that the Super All-Wheel Control SAWC, system, along with LED headlights and fog lights, are now standard on all trim levels. Last year's limited edition SE and SEL special edition trims disappear from the range and the Rallyet trim is added, but it's purely a styling package applied to the LE. The rest of the changes are minor. The SE gets silver front bumper trim and the sales lower body trim is now body colored. Lastly, there is a new available 18-inch alloy wheel design. The starting price of the new Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross is just under $26,000. Pros and cons. Stylish appearance. AWD is standard. Quiet, absorbent ride. Large trunk. Excellent warranty cover. Unimpressive gas mileage. Sedate performance. Substandard handling. Feels outdated. What's the price of the 2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross? With its $25,795 MSRP, the price of the 2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross ES is around $2,000 up over last year's model, but this does reflect the additional new equipment, such as the LED headlights and fog lights. Next in line is the LE, which will cost you $27,045. After that, it's the SE at $28,045, the SEL at $29,495 and the Rallyet at $29,995. These prices don't include the $1,445 destination fee. 2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross Handling and Driving Impressions Given that the Eclipse moniker comes from a beloved sports coupe of blessed memory, and since there's a trim level named after Mitsubishi's rally at motorsport division, you'd be forgiven for expecting excitement when piloting the Eclipse Cross. But you'd be disappointed. It's all bluster and pretends because the Eclipse Cross doesn't like to be thrown around. It leans around corners, and the light steering is tuned for plodding around town, not carving up canyons. Except for some patter over high-frequency bumps, the ride is comfortable and quiet, with no pretensions of sportiness, despite its wistful name. The powertrain doesn't make up the deficit, either, and with only 152 horsepower on tap, performance is sedate at best. The CVT does play well with the turbocharged engine at least, and doesn't send the revs soaring unnecessarily. But the overall experience is forgettable, and the Rallyet trim is nothing more than a styling exercise. Verdict, is the 2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross a good SUV? The Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross does have its good points, like stylish good looks, a large trunk, comfortable and quiet ride, and a class-leading warranty. However, beyond these, there's little to make the Eclipse Cross stand out in a sea of talent. It's five years old now and feels it, despite its updates. The cabin is boring, the handling a bit ponderous, and the performance weak. Sadly, in a land of CRVS, CX-50s, and IV-4S, the Eclipse Cross is hardly a blip on the compact crossover radar. 
its name and especially the almost comically named rally at Trim pluck at the heartstrings of fans that remember Mitsubishi's performance and racing history, but there's nothing to back it up, and it's purely an exercise in nostalgia. What 2023 Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross model should I buy? The SE represents the mid-range sweet spot and is very good value for money at $28,000. Notable features found here and not on the ES and LE are navigation, a power driver's seat, a six-speaker audio system, and dual-zone climate control. It also adds a few important driver assists, namely lane change assist, blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert. The sales leather and surround view camera are tempting, but at nearly $30,000, it becomes hard to justify a new Mitsubishi Eclipse Cross crossover over its better rivals in the segment, so rather stick to the SE. 2023 Eclipse Cross Exterior The Eclipse Cross looks much like any other compact crossover SUV out there, but some styling elements for its reintroduction to the market in the USA should help it stand out a little. The large dynamic shield grille bordered by sleek LED daytime running lights is definitely eye-catching. In the alcove created by this design are the headlights, which are LEDs across the board from this year, and are accompanied by standard LED fog lights. The rear end looks reserved now, but minimalism is very much in style at the moment. A roof spoiler is standard across the range and hints at some sporting aspirations. The standard wheels are 16-inch alloys, growing to 18 inches from the LE upwards. The Ralliot trim is a styling exercise with a Ralliot rear spoiler and unique red lower body trim pieces, a red Ralliot front splitter, and Ralliot side decals. Dimensions Most small crossovers share similar dimensions, and the Eclipse Cross is no different. It measures 179 inches in length, and has a 105.1 inch wheelbase, providing it with a decent amount of cabin space. However, a slightly narrow width of 71.1 inches does hamper this a little. The vehicle stands 66.5 inches tall. Ground clearance is 8 inches on SE and 8.5 inches on the rest. The base ES weighs in at 3,428 pounds, while the SE and SEL models max out the scales at 3,505 pounds. 2023 Eclipse Cross Interior The interior of the Eclipse has always been one of its strengths. The materials used aren't of the highest quality, but most cheap plastics are hidden from view and placed outside of high traffic areas. The layout of all the features is ergonomically sound, especially with the infotainment screen being placed closer to the driver since last year. The standard list of features is decent, but you'll want to upgrade to at least the LE to get the best goodies. With all this said, though, the Mazda CX-50 and Kia Sportage are still better equipped and have a smarter overall interior design. Seating and interior space Because of its short wheelbase and narrow width, the Eclipse lacks in terms of interior space. There are seats for five, but putting more than two in the back is probably not wise. There is 39.5 inches of headroom for those up front and 40.9 inches of legroom. Those in the back have to make do with 35.3 inches of legroom, but they still get a decent 37.3 inches of headroom. This drops to 36.7 inches with the panoramic roof installed. A six-way manual driver's seat is standard, but it can be upgraded to an 8-way power adjustable seat on upper trims. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.